Alright, I know I was just poking fun and shit earlier. You know what I'm saying? Because you do that. Well, let me tell you something. You little young niggas that thought y'all niggas had the game locked and sold the fuck up and didn't want to take time to talk to us old school niggas and hear what we had to say. Oh, you old school. You irrelevant. No, motherfucker. We made you relevant. All right? And we understood how it was to get jerked on deals. All right, so now y'all niggas got to sign these 360 deals. But if you would have took the time to talk to your old head like myself, you wouldn't be trapped in that shit and you'd know a little bit more about your motherfucking business. And all y'all niggas that's sitting around talking about, oh, Shan, shut up, you a broke nigga. Nigga, I'm far from fucking broke. I just choose to be a bum. Is all I'm saying. Any nigga out this motherfucker that know my stilo will tell you that nigga ain't no bum by far. You know what I'm saying? I ain't no bum by far. All right? Now, if y'all niggas would have sat back and listened to the old heads, y'all niggas wouldn't be trapped in this 360 deal. We used our music to propel our culture. They used you young motherfuckers to destroy our shit. They made every fucked up thing in the neighborhood popular. Well, Chuck D's, where's the motherfucking X-Clans? Y'all ain't even got none. All y'all niggas do is talk about motherfucking this, that, and the third, which make black lives motherfucking matter now. You understand? But all lives motherfucking matter. You know what I mean? But in the end of the day, they used you stupid motherfuckers to fuck up our community. I don't have that on my back. I tried to teach the community the right shit to go. Y'all niggas didn't listen to the old school heads. So, you got to bear the fucking grunt of this shit on your back that our fucking communities are fucked up because of niggas like y'all with your bullshit mumble rap and whatever the fuck else y'all niggas got going on because y'all didn't listen to the old school niggas that we use this as our fucking way of teaching and uplifting our culture. They fooled you motherfuckers. They didn't tell y'all that, oh, only one or two of you niggas is going to get to the real money. And all that money you throwing in the motherfucking club, you dumbass. Ain't nobody told you that motherfucking the IRS gonna come see your ass for that? Oh, you ain't got a receipt for that 100000 you just do. Mm-hmm. Nigga, a lot of you young niggas, right? You get one hit record, you get a lot of money, and then you disappear. Mm-hmm. Now, 10 years from now, when you done threw all them hundreds of thousands in the motherfucking club, you could dip the motherfucking bill collector. You can't dip the IRS, motherfucker. So all that shit that you got sitting in your house thinking, "Ah, I'm that motherfucker. You should have talked to us old school niggas. We'd have kept you out of some of them fucking binds that you about to be in. But since y'all niggas don't want to listen to old heads because we old heads and we don't know shit. Know how we know you think like that? Because our fucking kids even try and think like that. So you get one of these upside your motherfucking oops upside your head. Alright, so think about that shit Since y'all, I know it's a couple of y'all wanna say Oh, that nigga Shan talking shit Well, I'm talking real shit Right now They use you young motherfuckers to fuck our whole society up 